everyone welcome back to graceful beauty my name is sherry and today i wanted to share with you an absolutely amazing skincare and also a makeup product that i've been testing out for probably three months maybe three four months i bought it back in july and every single time i use this product my makeup i feel like my makeup looks absolutely amazing and this is the product that i'm talking about this is by Revlon. It's their Color Stay Prep and Protect. It's a primer slash base. And it says it provides moisture and oil control for up to 24 hours. So if you ever watch my channel, you'll know that I actually do not like uh, makeup primers at all. So for the most part, I just don't wear them. But when I saw this one, the main thing that caught my attention is that it has an SPF 34 in it. And it is an all mineral SPF. So of course, I had to try it. Now I already apply a super thick layer of sunscreen before I even do my makeup, but this not only is skincare because it's your sunscreen, but it also acts as your makeup primer and if you have lighter skin tone, you could just wear this and not wear foundation over top. Now I do think that if you have darker skin, you really have to rub this in good because it could leave a little bit of a white cast, but let me just show you how beautiful this looks and on my skin tone, I'm medium to medium tan so that you can kind of see what it looks like on me. It has such a light peachy tint, but look at how thin this product is. It's not like a thick, heavy product, so it's like a really nice nice lightweight moisturizer when I apply it on my face now I don't put as much of this on my face as I would you know a sunscreen I use a good half a teaspoon of sunscreen on my face this just adds that extra protection but what I absolutely love about this is number one after it applies and it soaks in my pores nearly disappear it just kind of fills everything in but it doesn't feel heavy or cakey and my makeup is not fresh I've actually had my makeup on for maybe six six hours somewhere around there and I feel like it just still looks fresh and glowing but it's not fading in any spots and that's one reason I never really cared for primers because I didn't feel like a lot of primers would help my makeup stay on longer and honestly a lot of times I felt like a lot of the primers I would use would actually make my makeup uh, get oily quick and things would just start to slide around. This does make my face feel hydrated, but like I said, it also adds some oil control. Now, I don't know if you have super dry skin if you would want to use this. I think this is really good if you have normal skin, and even if you have oily skin, I think that you would really, really enjoy this. If you do have super dry skin, then I would, of course, moisturize first. And again, I would not use this as your only source of sunscreen. As you can see, the way I apply it, I only use a small amount and I just really try to focus on, you know, the areas that I want to make the pores look a little smooth and filled in and of course, minimize shine. Now, of course, I like shine, I like a glow, but I don't wanna, you know, look like a grease slick all day long. So since it does have the proper amount of titanium dioxide and zinc oxide in it, you actually could use this as your only source of sunscreen if that's what you choose to do. But of course, don't just use a couple little dots, you know, like I just did. Make sure you use the proper amount to get full coverage. I do think that it is a very nice hydrating product, but yet at the same time, it has something magical in it that hydrates, yet it still controls any oil production if you get shiny during the day. But it grips onto your foundation. It makes my skin look super poreless and flawless, and I just feel like it just gives me a beautiful glow, but yet I don't have any breakthrough oil. I have not had to touch up with powder or blotting sheets or anything, and I've had this on, like I said, maybe five or six hours. So this is a product I've been testing out for quite a long time now, so I can definitely give it my thumbs up approval. You know, a lot of times we do like first impression videos, and it's like, really, what are you gonna get out of a first impression? So I try to test things out for as long as I possibly can so that I can give you guys really good feedback. If you've tried this product, leave a comment down below and let me know your thoughts on it. I am absolutely obsessing over this product. I am gonna buy a couple more because I love it that much. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did like this video, I hope you will give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed to my channel but you would like to be, just look down below and make sure you tap on that subscribe button as well. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate each and every one of you and I hope you have a great day.